guys, welcome to Day by Day Vlogs. Hopefully you enjoy the video. My name is Maddie, and you can follow me on Instagram at patchmaddie2008. And here's my dog. Hopefully you enjoy the video. Bye! We are super excited for an amazing week, starting with today, which is horseback riding. Homeschool is underway, and the girls are doing what? Riding prompts. Riding prompts. So we have all of our riding prompts in here, and they have to pick one out and write about it in their journal. Just wait, come back here. What did you get? Nothing. Come on, what's it say? It says, what is something that really makes you angry? What are you going to write? What is something that really makes something you angry? Something that makes me angry. Is writing! Is Gabby! Why? Because she steals my dog. I know. We need two golden doodles. No, it's my dog! Wait. This dog pretty much lives and breathes between Gabby's legs, but Sophie needs a turn too. Right. This is the best compromise. Riding double. I need to do it. Sophie's falling off the butt. <laughs> Sophie, you're off the doors. <laughs> We're going fast. <laughs> Poor Sophie always falls off. I am so proud of us, Gabby and I. We have figured out exponents today. We totally figured out exponents. People think you, you mean have to. You refigured it. Yeah, I refigured it out and then was able to teach her. But um, we've been struggling for the last couple of days before spring break uh, with exponents. And um, people break. think you have to be so super smart and that you have to be like a teacher to do homeschool. You learn along with your kids. You remember how to do things. And doing it together makes you feel so much better. At home, it's so much more casual and it's like you're learning together. Together and it's such an amazing feeling. So you get exponents now? Kind of. Yeah, all right, let's see. Right, that's exactly right. Uh, no, you're doing 25 times this five. Uh -huh, I know. So she's working on exponents. This girl over here. She's working on my dog. It's working on her dog. You can't have homeschool without dogs in the middle of them. All right, this girl over here is just about to learn times tables for the very first time. Are you excited? I've already did times tables once. Yeah, once. Okay, so. Because I wanted to learn how to do it. But before she does that, she has to finish her estimating differences and subtraction. She has four days of this. Okay, so then you write one and underneath that one. And I'm confused. And she's confused. So now that this girl has got it going on, I'm going to go over here with this girl. Okay, I had to put my dog down because she was getting annoyed. Whoa! The sunrise, late nights, wishing that this would be over. Cold eyes, the same vice. We won't be getting any closer. We're supposed to be. All right, you guys, we are off to the barn, <laughs> and I have some exciting house news for you guys. So, um, Sam uh, called the real estate agent this morning that was showing us the house yesterday, and she you. said they have an offer on it. And we're like, really? Like, how do you buy a house? Like, you, we went to a party after. We had hardly no time to talk, so we thought, okay, well, we'll call them in the morning. There's an offer. So we got put off a little because it's terrible to have competition. We don't want to have like pay a ton of money for a farm. It's not worth it because there's competition. But then we just Sam walked in the door tonight and he's like, "Let's do it. Let's just put in an offer." And I was like, "Okay, let's do it." He always like does that though. Like just when life seems really bleak, Sam's always like, "Let's do this." And then I'm like, "Oh, that would be so fun." So if we're gonna do it. He's gonna call. Are you gonna call while we're at the barn? Yeah. Yeah. So he's gonna put in an offer, and we're gonna do a conditional offer so that we could do um, a home inspection just to make sure because it's kind of, yeah, just to make sure. But anyway, yeah, so you guys are gonna try and put in an offer tonight, so wish us luck. Good morning! Okay, I just wanted to say that. And if we get the farm, then we will be able to get two surprises. I'll tell you. We will get a miniature pony and a goat. A 
a baby goat and a baby with a triple B. Yeah, so Sophia hates the house. She wants a house with two stories like we have now. So the only way that we could get her to agree to move to the house if we get it is to tell her about all the animals that we could get. Okay, our horse, who is an internet horse, it's always on camera, 100 million times a week. She just spooked at the camera so bad, like she's never seen it before. Sabrina, it's, it's these guys, they're our friends. She, oh, that looks so, it was so soft, and then she smashed me. Right, Gabby, you ready to give Jasmine a run? Gabby's got her big girl panties on today, right? Got your big girl pants on today? She's anxious today. That's her anxious look. Fun fact about Gabby when there's other that kids. Is not the job, Gabby. So here's the deal today. Every time you miss the jump, I'm putting it up a hole. So I would suggest you just jump it. Just take a deep breath, jump it, and don't even think about anything. And A, turn and jump it. Look, Chloe's not even going to let you go around this. <laughs> <laughs> That's what friends are for. Friends block the way so you can't avoid the jump. Hold on when you need a friend I'll never let you go again Reach out when your mind's uneasy Cause I'll understand Hold on when you need a friend I'll stay here to the end Get up, don't hang your head We'll take it step by step Now I'm living in a matchbox All this time All it needed was a little spark Give me my heart back cause somebody stole it And put it in your head Give me my heart back cause somebody stole it And put it in your head Give me my heart back
barn. I got Gabby and Sabrina. She feels bad because she never gets to ride her anymore. I got Sophie and Jasmine. Okay, go ahead. And I have Spencer, the old guy. We can't get too close behind Jasmine because Jasmine's a pony kicker. She's in. Jasmine hates life. Jasmine is retiring soon because she's just unhappy now. She just has changed. She doesn't love her job anymore, so she's going to retire. She's still good at her job. She's just not in love with it. Spencer. Helping with chores. Spencer's got his hay and his grain. Blue's got his grain. Jasmine, here comes your grain. Good girl. I'm frozen. My feet are frozen. Everything on me is frozen. All right, we have a heated tack room. So I spent a lot of time in there today just to warm up my feet. That's where Sam practically lives in the tack room because he stays warm. All right, we are home from the barn. I'm full of static electricity. The dogs are all inside. It's always so exciting to come home because dogs go crazy. Oh, Macy, Macy. Out. I know, Macy, because I have to go pee. Out. Okay, anyways, I wanted to give you guys a quick update. So uh, Sam uh, put in an offer on the farm that we saw yesterday. It's really small, but I think that we could use the space well. It was in our price range. Um, uh, four offers went in. Four offers. We were like the third one or the fourth one or something. So uh, we won't know. It'll be presented tomorrow morning. Yeah, so a well, wish us luck. We offered full price because there were so many offers going in. And um, yeah, like very, very little conditions. So hopefully we get that farm. It's like the second time we've ever tried to put in an offer. Um, actually, the first time we tried to put in an offer on another horse last, last year and last fall. And um, it got sold before we could put the offer in. So this time we got an offer in. Are you excited? We could like own a farm, you guys. We could have horses. We could have baby goats. Gabby. Miniature ponies. Miniature ponies. What do you think? She's getting some food because like literally we come in and eat, don't we? Yes. Um, we come in, take our shoes off and eat. So do you think we're going to get the farm? Four offers. Four... Lucky number four, maybe we'll get it. I think we'll maybe get second choice. Anyway, I'm really excited. I really hope that we do, but we are gonna end today's video because it is late. Um, we have to edit the vlog and I need to go get in a really hot bath because I'm so cold. Are you cool? She doesn't wear the proper I, I wore out two pairs of winter weather. boots at the barn. I refuse to buy more. I'm like to, too cheap to buy another pair of winter boots. So I've been wearing my rubber boots and my feet are frozen. Mine or not. Yeah, but yeah. Anyway, that is it for today. And um, wish us luck, please. And we'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye. 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 And don't forget to make sure to hit that subscribe button down below.